Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel CapTech Pro. In this video, we'll learn how to add the stream video to the SharePoint page. So guys, without any delay, let's go to our lab environment and let's see how we can do that. So friends, we have logged in using my global admin credentials. And now I will click on this navigation menu. Let me click on show all and let's open the stream admin center. So here in the list, here we have the stream admin center. And here in streams, I have one video. Let me go to my content, click on videos. So this is the video which you guys usually see on my beginning of the video. So I want to add this video to a SharePoint page. So let's see how we can do that. So now I will go back to my SharePoint admin center and here I have one site with the name of page test. I want to add this particular video on this page. So let's see how we can, you know, do this. So as of now on this page, we have a news web part documents and most, most recent documents. So to add the stream video on this SharePoint page, what we can do, we can simply click on this edit option and we can edit this page. You can see we got an option to edit multiple web parts. Now here, if you will, you know, slightly hover your mouse just below any web part, here you will get an option of add a new web part in the column one. So I will click on this plus. Here we can simply type stream. So you can see it will give you the option of stream classic web part. I will select this. Now our web part is added. Simply you have to click on edit and here you will, you can see the display videos from your organization, Microsoft Steam classic video portal, and you can show top videos to find a specific video or the channel in the streams and paste its web address below. Okay. So here the first option is source. So here you, if you want all the videos of the stream to be displayed here, you can select this option. Then we have the option of sing single video. Okay. Now the second option is single video and the last option is channel. You can add the channel address here, but now will we have only the single video. So we'll go with the single video and here we have to give the address of the video. So to, to enter the address of the video, we'll go back to my stream. Okay, and uh, we'll click on my content and then videos. Here you will click on three dot and now you can click on share. From here you can directly copy the link of this particular video. And now you can go back to the same page. And here you can paste the video link of the stream. After pasting the link, you can select the when you want this video to be, you know, start at you can mention the time here and once you will add this you can simply click on republish so now all the users and member once they will you know visit the site will be able to see this video if you'll we'll play this video you can see it will be played on the sharepoint page and the same video you know the other members of this particular site will be able to see i have logged in with another user credentials of the same page. You can see the total three members have the access to this page. Rachit, Ritika, Rachit is the owner. This is my account. And then we have the Ritika and Peter. Let me minimize this and open the same site with the Ritika credentials. Let me minimize this and open the same site using the Peter credentials. Okay. So now we have logged in using the credentials of Peter. Let me refresh the page. And here you can see Peter can also see the same video. It will take a while to load. Okay. So you can see Peter can also see the same video and here you can also see how many views you got on this video and you can also post the comment and you can like the same video. So friends, that's how we add the video, which is there on the streams to the SharePoint page. That's conclude our video demonstration. For more informative videos, 
you can check my other video links on the screen and subscribe my channel and press bell icon for more upcoming videos i will see you guys in next video